my baby, oh my baby, my baby. Mm. Yeah, okay, guys. Um, really, um, it's really worrisome to see how relationships and marriages are crashing these days compared to the days of the eighties. All right, there are a lot of young relationships are not doing well. And here's what I want you to understand. You know, there's this tale of seeking for true love. The truth is, I really can't say if it's achievable or not. But they say true love is very difficult to find. But here's what I'm bringing to you, and I want you to listen clearly. You do not need true love to find a long-lasting, and emphatically I'm saying fulfilling relationship. So you don't just want a long-lasting relationship. The relationship has to be fulfilling. And I'll be telling you the three things you need. One, commitment. If you're going into a relationship genuinely for the purpose of achieving that family lifestyle in a marriage, then you must be ready to commit. A man must commit. A woman must commit. Then number two, sacrifice. People sacrifices. The woman sacrifices a lot. The man also has to place part of sacrifice. It, it is unjust for one person to be doing the sacrifice while the other person is you know, receiving the sacrifice. Both partners must give because both partners deserve to be loved. Number three, compromise. This is very essential. You know, the compromise part has to do especially with the part of listening to each other. You know, sometimes we get into arguments, sometimes we have our differences and it's normal because um, two different schools of thoughts, two different beings, having different backgrounds, different ideologies, psychologies, philosophies, coming together now to become one. It's not going to be easy. There must be breaches. The only way out is compromise. But it's going to be catastrophic when one person feels right all the time, especially the male figure who believes that he has to be listened to all the time. But here's what I want you to understand. The male figure should be listened to. The woman too has to be listened to. Wisdom determines when and who should be listened to at a particular time. There is a time you respect the authority of a man and you also respect the authority of a woman because they say men are the head, but women are the neck. But remember, if there is no neck, there's no position for the head to stand. So both people deserve to be heard. The wisdom is knowing when to listen to your man and the man knowing when to listen to his woman. So three things I just mentioned are the key things you need to sustain a long lasting and emphatically I'm saying fulfilling relationship. I'm saying fulfilling. I hope you get the word. So a long lasting is not a it has to be fulfilling commitment number one two sacrifice number three and then three compromise there must be these three of these in that relationship if you want it to be fulfilling and long lasting god bless you